What's going on guys? It's your boy John and Liquidator coming back with another video and it looked like the media is raging a war against Shador Sanders over his recent comments and I got an update on Justin Mayer and Khalil Benson. God, for this one here, we got to go all the way up the boulder. Let's get it. Let's go. For the last year, dog, we all know that the media has been raging this attack against Coach Prime and his family and his football team for no reason whatsoever. It seemed like every couple weeks, there's always some new article, some new report coming out about Coach Prime trying to, like, discredit his coaching ability, trying to attack the way he put together his football team. And if you guys don't know me by now, y'all know I got to pull up on him, man. So somebody got in my comment section earlier and told me critical information about these media outlets. Now, I have been seeing everything, but I didn't know it was that serious. He shared with me some recent articles that came out about Shador Sanders in regards to his recent comments that he made during his press conference last week. Now, we all recall Shador Sanders sitting down with the media and addressing Texas high school players and how he don't hear about any of those players anymore. Well, the media is trying to create some type of rage against him over his comments, bruh. Let me pull up some of these articles and share them with you real quick. So as you guys can see here, man, there is quite a few articles going in on Shador Sanders about his recent comments, bruh. And this is crazy because we don't see this happen with any other college quarterback. We don't see any other coaches getting ridiculed and scrutinized just for speaking their mind. And I believe there is a big reason why because they do not like coach prime and i hate to go back to this but we already know why bro it's because he's confident he say what he want to say and people just some reason got a problem with it now the same thing goes with shador sanders bro people don't like this young man because he's extremely well at his position he's very outspoken and you can't really slip nothing past him and the media really don't like that and so I just don't get why these big time companies try to, you know, raise these little mini wars against them. But at the end of the day, us as fans, we got to just ignore it all. Now, moving on to the next story, Leo Benson and Justin Mayers went on Instagram Live to chop it up about the new NIL situation and to talk about spring break. Guys, I'm about to play the clip and come back with some commentary. Let's get it. In the portal. Oh, my God. They said, hey, that. Oh, I'm. For sure. It's get back time, nigga. You ever play Nebraska? I mean, that would be my last college football game ever against Nebraska. For real. So. <laughs> For it's 50 real. dogs. No, no, you good. 50. I didn't know you weren't saying nigga. You good, you good. Uh, from the players, because the media prime thing. Yeah, you know how it is. Like, the media, go, everybody going to portray how they feel about somebody. Like, they ain't going to never. They going to try to make it sound like it's good. But at yeah. the end of the day, if they don't really like him as a person, like, then. They're not gonna make him sound like you feel me like a good coach. Like even about how he sounds, you just have to be here and understand like how he is as a coach. Like the same people that be like asking for pictures and stuff, be the same ones hating after the end of the day. It's sick. Yeah, just to say they met Coach Prime, you know. <laughs> they said, "Who's the best D lineman y'all ever had to block?" In my ever career or here? Yeah. Who's that, y'all? Y'all ever had the ball? Okay, ever. Um, what's his name? Um, he played for Michigan. He was number fifty-eight at the time. It was twenty twenty-two. I forgot. Was it Mozzie? Mozzie? Um, he played D tackle. He he was on Cowboys now. Are oh, you talking about a guy that from Michigan? Yeah, number fifty-eight. His name like Mozzie or something like that. Mozzie or. Yeah, he's strong, right? That bro, that bro, bro. strong. That ain't the word. Imagine putting Chadozi and uh, TC in the same body. Oh my god, that is, that, is, that is strong, bro. Like, bro, he's strong. It's yeah, Bobby, that, 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 he liked that. I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't even gonna count. As you guys seen in that clip there, man, Khalil Benson them shedding light about the media as well. Get down in the comment section. Let me know y'all thoughts about this. Keep them bells on because you know I'm going to bring you the news like always, man. Until next time, shake the haters off. I'm out of here. Peace out. You cut You should have seen by now. You cut Yeah, they talking about it. We coming. They doubting us. They say it. They're coming, they 
think it's a game. We coming. I don't give a damn what they say. You best believe. We coming.